Hi, I'm Troy Robbins, Product Manager for Tsunami Compressed Air Solutions and Air System Specialist. Today we're going to talk about the Tsunami three-stage precision membrane dryer. First, the inlet air travels into the Tsunami water separator down through its inner tube. When it reaches the baffle at the bottom, the air is reversing direction as well as expanding in the larger area of the outer tube using gravity to pull the bulk waters out into the water sump. We then accelerate that air up through these holes in the baffle and use centrifugal separation through the stainless steel mesh to allow smaller water droplets to form into larger ones which get pushed to the outer wall and are able to run down into the sump. We then travel into the oil coalescing filter, taking the air from the inside to the outside where the different layers of the media allow oil aerosols and droplets to form into large droplets which then are wicked down to the baffle and drop into the sump. That water and oil free air then travels into the activated carbon filter using an adsorption process in order to grab the oil vapors. We then take that filtered air and bring it into the membrane dryer core which then as the air is traveling down through the, the hollow tubes of the membrane dryer, providing dry air downstream, we take a small portion of that air and drive it through an orifice at the bottom to remove the water vapor and discharge it through these sweep holes. The membrane dryer core, as I said, is made up of a bunch of hollow tubes, which is epoxied at the top and the bottom and loose in the middle. So as compressed air is traveling down through these tubes, the chemical makeup of the material allows water vapor to permeate through. So as compressed air is going down, water vapor is escaping and being held in the center of the tube. So as dry air is going downstream, we take a small portion of that and drive it through an orifice at the bottom, which then takes dry air and sweeps that water vapor away through the sweep holes at the top of the membrane core. It's very important that you protect this membrane core from oil and oil vapors as long-term exposure to oil and oil vapors will allow the hollow tube material to start to want to break down. And if the hollow tubes start to break rather than dry air going downstream, that compressed air then just vents to the center and escapes through these sweep holes, making the membrane dryer less and less efficient. And that's why it's so important to make sure to keep oil out the tsunami membrane dryer. So as I touched on, we have dry air going downstream, but all the bulk water and oil that's been collected through the filtering process of our water separator and oil coalescing filter is then ejected through the electronic drain. Uh, we use the off time to set the frequency of, of how often we want it to discharge and make sure we're removing the bulk liquids. For extreme heavy duty situations where your air system has a lot of water and oil, you may want to set that off time between 5 and 10 minutes. Uh, the on time should always be somewhere between 0.5 and 1 seconds. You want short, quick blasts. And if you have a lot of water and oil to remove, you just want to have those quick blasts more and more often. Now that we, I've shown you how our Tsunami three-stage precision membrane dryer works, I want to show you exactly what it is we're trying to accomplish. Here I'm going to measure an air system. So this monitor measures relative humidity as well as dew point. The higher the humidity and the higher the dew point, the more likely you are to see water show up downstream. So as you can see, our humidity was climbing up near 40% relative humidity and our dew point was at 47 degrees and climbing. Uh, more than likely, we're going to see some water show up downstream uh, as the air is being used or cooling off as it travels through an air system. So to avoid that, what we do is we use the Tsunami three-stage precision membrane dryer. So we're filtering and now we're drying the air as I explained earlier. Here's what you can expect for your air quality after you use the Tsunami three-stage precision membrane dryer. So as you can see, our relative humidity dropped down to 0% and the dew point was below zero, which means that the air, which means that the likelihood of seeing moisture downstream is slim to none. 
Here you can hear the sweep air that I talked about earlier. So as that air travels down through that core, providing that dry air downstream, some of that dry air is driven through that orifice, which then sweeps the air away. Having this air leak out of the top of these sweep holes is natural and nothing to be concerned about. Thanks for watching this short video. Make sure to visit our website at www.tsunami.us.com for more information or to get a quote.